Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech. And if you're looking behind me, that is my code block snowman. Friends, I've got a cool idea for an extension. So let's get cracking. All right, friends, so this is a lesson that I've already completed. There will be a link up above and a link in the description if you haven't made your snowman. Now, I have got a code blocks video that teaches you how to add eyes and then a belly button, and it challenges you to solve this with code, but I was talking with a student today, and that student said, hey, what if I want to play in the traditional editor? Friends, we can make that happen just this easy. Click export, and we want to export as a part. When it pops up, of course, we're gonna name it Snowman. And right now you can see he is blank. I'm not gonna fill in any of these. I'm not gonna lock the part size. I am just going to save the shape. Now, once again, if you wanna try and solve this with code, that is a cool challenge. There will be a card up above to get you that as well. If you wanna just make your snowman cool in the regular Tinkercad design space, all you have to do is click on 3D designs, hit create new design. And now friends, when you click on the your creations button this blank one in a moment will turn into your awesome snowman when you bring him out here you can pick the size i'm gonna hold shift and make him a little bigger and then we need to add pieces to our awesome snowman you can add anything you want the student i was talking to wanted to add the pilgrim hat well we already saved that as a part so i'm going to just hit more shapes until i can find my pilgrim hat i could also use my fun eyeballs i created or we can just make them from scratch. So I'm hitting more shapes again and again and again until I find it. And where is my pilgrim hat? There it is. I'm gonna move this up with control shift in the up arrow. And now my cool little snowman has, I'm gonna do shift squish, a hat that fits his head pretty darn decent. So friends, you can have as much fun as you want making this dude unbelievably awesome. I'm gonna use the cone this time to lift it up. I'm gonna use the arrow keys to nudge it back. And then once again, if you do shift squish, you can get it to the exact size that fits your cool snowman. Friends, if you can't get your scaling right, remember you can adjust these down smaller and you can just have an awesome time turning the snowman into the person you want. There's my control D now to make a second eye and I just nudge it across. I'll give him a nose. Uh, once again, if you can find someplace flat, like I'm gonna use the piece of this hat. Now when I go back to basic shapes, I can make a nose out of say a cone. Once again, it's huge. Shift squish. I'm gonna make it orange because they usually make them out of a carrot. I will stretch it longer and then I can just shift nudge it into place until I am as happy as can be. I'm doing control down arrow to sink it in. And friends, you can just have a blast making your snowman as awesome as can be. I'm gonna, of course, click up here and name it snowman with my initials. I'll put a five after this because you know I've made a bunch. And last but not least, friends, if you make an awesome snowman, you can click on this button right here to generate a link copy a link, and then you can share it with me. I am HL Mod Tech on Facebook, Instagram, and Gmail. Or you could also reach out to me on Twitter. I am HL Tinkercad. If those options are not available to you, you can visit hlmodtech.com. Of course, I have the Tinkercad page with tons of amazing lessons. I also have the sweet built-in messaging tool. You can click on that, fill in your information, and reach out to me almost instantly. Friends, I'd like to leave you with a challenge here. I create a new Doodle Jam every Thursday. If you would create an awesome snowman with all kinds of decorations and send me a share link, I will take a screenshot of your image and I will actually put your Tinkercad project in next week's Doodle Jam. If you haven't seen Doodle Jams, check the cards up above and you can see what all the cool jams are about. Finally, friends, of course, thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you got a question, comment, or a suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a